Hello everyone, welcome to another episode of the Tombstone Tourist. Today I'm in Lewisburg, West Virginia at the uh, Rosewood Cemetery. And I'm going to be visiting the final resting place of the man who made the phrase, Come on down. You're the next contestant on The Price is Right. Famous. Johnny Olson was a longtime announcer on the TV game show The Price is Right. And is best known for telling excited contestants to come on down. John and his wife Penny are resting in the small mausoleum here in the Rosewood Cemetery, which is at the top of the hill, all the way in the back of the cemetery. Rosewood is a small to medium-sized cemetery located adjacent to Highway 219, a mile or so south of Interstate 64. Entering the mausoleum, walk straight back, turn left, and it's there, on the wall, you'll find the cremation niche of Johnny and Penny Olson. Johnny Olson was born on October 12, 1910, in Wyndham, Minnesota. As a young man, he worked a number of odd jobs before beginning a career in radio, working first for WTMJ in Minneapolis, Minnesota. In the mid-1940s, Johnny moved from radio to a new medium called television. He started off as the announcer for the TV show Break the Bank and named that tune. In 1958, TV game show producers Mark Goodson and Bill Todd hired him as the announcer for the TV game show, Play Your Hunch, which was hosted by Merv Griffin. Over the next several years, Goodson and Totman produced a number of successful TV game shows, such as To Tell the Truth, Watch My Line and I've Got a Secret. And one time or another, Johnny Olson served as the announcer for each of these shows. But Johnny was most famous for his 14-year run as the announcer on The Price is Right, which was hosted by Bob Barker. In addition to warming up the audience before taping, he would often engage in some friendly banter with Bob Barker during the tapings. But he's best remembered for calling the contestants to come on down, as you're the next contestant on The Price is Right. The phrase come on down became so popular that every Price is Right announcer since Olson has used it. During his time with The Price is Right, Johnny bought a farm in Greenbrier County, West Virginia, just outside of Lewisburg. He called it Buckingham Acres. When Johnny wasn't busy on the West Coast, he could often be found there, enjoying a simpler and slower life. On October 6, 1985, Johnny suffered a stroke on his way to work was transported to a hospital in Santa Monica, California, where he died on October 12, 1985. He was 75 years old. Well, this is where I'm going to end this video. 
I hope you've enjoyed my visit to Rosewood Cemetery and the final resting place of noted TV announcer, Johnny Olson. If you did, please give me a thumbs up below. If you want to keep up with my future travels, be sure to ring that bell and subscribe. So, until my next adventure, it's time for me to say so long, everyone, and thanks for watching.